Hi, I'm Daryl Popper, AIFD, floral designer and visual display artist for Shinoda Design Center. Today I'm going to show you how to embellish a wine bottle. I think it's a matter of personal preference taking uh, wine to someone's home as a uh, hostess gift, but I just think wine bags are just kind of eh. But I'm going to show you some fun things to do with a ribbon that they can use for something else after. Now this is our beautiful, beautiful ribbon by D. Stevens. Gorgeous, gorgeous uh, jewels, embellishments. And I'm going to take a small piece of this and we're going to double it, cut it. Now this ribbon again is wired. I'm going to take two thin pieces of wire and I'm going to floral tape them. Just put tape on the top, twist, and I stretch it when I'm doing it and just let it fall and just wind, wind, wind. I think I'll flip one up just a little bit and pinch it. Twist the back. Now because this is wired, we're able to pull it around and shape it. The wires that pop out of the bottom, we wanna get these out of here. Don't want some of it to get cut. I think what I'm gonna do on this one, because the ribbon is so pretty, I'm not gonna dovetail this. <clears throat> I'm gonna just kinda of curl it a little bit. Now, I'm gonna take this Put it around the bottle loosely, then put it to pull it to the front of it. Twist, cut. I want to be able to take this so we can pull this off afterwards. All right, now we're going to want some embellishment on this. So I take, I keep all my scraps from past projects. And here's a little bit of kind of um, platinum, champagne, and very, very minimal. You don't need a whole lot when you're doing these. I love this artificial cedar. It's great. I'm using a glue pan. Um, you can use a glue gun. I'm so used to using a glue pan. A uh, glue pan can have uh, glue sticks in it. This one is uh, hot melt chips that uh, are very, very secure when you put your... Uh, projects together with it. It doesn't come apart as easy. I just, it all depends on what you're making. Glue guns sometimes are just perfect. A little bit of Christmas berries. Okay. Here's our little gold one. Now, it just, it's really kind of just kind of a little decorative thing when you go somewhere as a gift. And after the holiday is over, or during the holiday, they can take this off. You could run a ribbon through this. It could hang off of a knob on a cabinet. You could have a couple stacks of books. It looks very pretty, a little decorative thing on top of books. But, um, you know, when, whenever uh, you like a little accent, a little Christmas accent, this is a perfect way to do it where a flower arrangement or a swag is just too big. But please don't hang this on the top of a lampshade. My grandmother used to do that. So this will make a perfect little housewarming gift when you go to someone's home for Christmas. Thanks for being with us and enjoy us for more tutorials from Shinoda Design Center.